I'm Gregory Dawson, filling in for Clifford Baines, who was hit by two cars. The first car threw him into the path of the second car. The unemployment crisis has worsened in recent months with little sign of recovery. Should the nation's millions of unemployed spring for a new Apple computer, given that it might assist them in a job search? Absolutely they should. The of course right. it's expensive, but the unemployed need a Mac Absolutely. to stay on top of job listings, update their oh, cover letter. And Macs come with iMovie so they can edit together a neat little video resume. Guys, oh, guys, I'm really like sorry. Time. I forgot to bring the cups today. I didn't know we'd be drinking the Apple Kool-Aid well, here. Here we go. I mean, cash-strapped Americans don't need to spend an extra $800 for a stupid little glowing Apple logo on their computer, because that's all you're getting. I don't understand <laughs> why an unemployed person needs a new computer at all. Did their old one stop working? Well, no, Laura Lee, but you know, it's important to stay on top of the latest hardware. Right, and plus, you know, if they get a MacBook Pro, they could use it to learn graphic design. Exactly. Which is like, and they could pick up cousin. some freelance graphic design work uh, while they're waiting for yes, a, a more I need to teach myself thing. graphic design. Exactly. I keep telling myself oh, I'm going to do, but you know, I never But why spend thousands? Why are we spending thousands on a tiny toy which is all it is, when you go down to Best Buy and for $400 you get a Toshiba. I still don't Perfectly understand good. why the unemployed don't use the computer that they have out in their garage, like mine. I go out there, I turn it on, and there in the folder marked recipes are my recipes. But Laura Lee, if you want to work in a creative field, you need a Mac. A Mac yeah, is the just, tool just for creative professionals. When I go into a cafe it, and I see somebody using a Dell computer, oh, I turn the other way, I'm like, what, what, is, what is he working on, his manifesto? Oh, yes, yeah, Mr. Jobs, whatever you say, and Mr. Apple, Jobs. Apple, may I remind you, it's not the only corporation that's vital to the needs of the unemployed at mm -hmm. this difficult time. Netflix, Starbucks. You need a I Starbucks mean, boost when you're spending all day filling out your LinkedIn profile. Are we still That's talking right. about computers? Because aren't there Kinkos on every <sighs> single Kinkos. corner what are we, where huh? you I mean, can use their computers if you really need look, to? Look, the fact is that Americans should be supporting innovation. That's what drives the economy, spending. But wasn't the recent financial crisis caused by a liquidity shortfall of just this kind of overspending? I mean, didn't the subprime mortgage fiasco teach us? Laura that Lee, if we shut up. You don't know anything, okay? You can't participate in this conversation because you don't know the specifics of what we're talking about. Your opinion is not valid. It doesn't matter. David has a point, Laura Lee. I mean, you really just don't seem to understand anything that we're discussing. Sorry. Laura Lee, um, you, you can go. Well, I'm serious, you should go. Okay. Oprah shocked her studio audience today by revealing a second Oprah. Stay tuned to the Onion News Network for more on that story.